Welcome to another edition of the Morning Cup, sponsored by Kestrel Aircraft. We're taking a look at that heads-up display that we talked about earlier today. And don't know if you can see it or not, but what's happening here is we have a uh, projector that ultimately can be mounted in an aircraft that takes its signal from the mirroring function in iOS. So whatever you're displaying on your iPad can be displayed as a heads-up display. Charlie, I'm a little unclear earlier when we were talking about this. Is the display inside or outside the cockpit? The hardware is inside, but the image looks like it's floating out in front of you, about three meters. And it's at, it'll be at focus at infinity. What you're looking at here is an a uh, map, like a v, an IFR uh, chart, put in night mode. We're taxiing back now in Aspen, getting ready to take off. And that's what you're seeing live, connected. We have our iPhone connected to the AOPAJ that's sitting there. And then, uh, so you're seeing a simulated image. The pilot is actually running this uh, demonstration. It thinks it's at Aspen, getting ready to depart. Okay, so what we're seeing here is using the iPad in a similar fashion to Google Glass, and we're doing a little bit of augmented reality based on data in the environment. Yep, we're using that simulator to put us at Aspen, and we're using Garmin Pilot right out of the box, displayed up onto our heads-up display. Allie, you're in Alyssa, you're in our view. <laughs> uh, there we are, so we're getting ready to finish taxiing back. And we're going to take off here in a moment. It's very cool. And we could have any display. We could have a synthetic vision display. We could have a PFD display. We can have whatever's on that iPad or iPhone. In addition, some app developers over time will develop specific apps that will be designed to be on this display. So there won't be things like control buttons and things of that nature. There will be the things that we need. Now we're getting ready to take the runway. So we're moving on to the runway, and then we're going to depart. And all of that is being shown onto the screen. And this is an interesting departure. Yep, it's off. Okay, so that takes care of being able to see the view. Okay. Well, hopefully that was enough to give you a little bit of a taste of what the heads-up display from my Go Flight will be like when it comes into production later on this year. We normally don't show things that are that are this early in development, but as we were traveling around the show, this was something so cool we just wanted to share it with you. So you can find this and a lot of other interesting stuff at themorningcup.net. Thanks, as always, for watching.